Hello, this is Double A with another WWE Supercard video for the date of Tuesday, November the 14th. Um, today is the last day for Season 3 of Supercard. Tomorrow, Season 4 is going to be released and available for playing and lots of good fun. Lots of great material out there from tons of providers that gives you the lowdown as to what you're going to expect with Season 4. Check them out. Um, you can check out like Super Zone Barbecue. You can check out Luigi, Luigi Mania, I should say, Bad Lad Dad, again, um, Biggie Dude, giving lots of people props on Twitter. So there's, I'm sure there's a lot of others as well. I know there's others there as well, but just don't follow them as much. But I'm not gonna keep that from giving them the credit that they're due as well. Um, myself, I've been a super card player since well. Can I really truly say this? Been a super card player since day one. This is what the cards looked like back in the day. There was a couple of times that I took a break. Once during season two, around WrestleMania tier, took the whole tier off. Was getting to a point where I needed a break. And then took a break. If you're familiar with my rant video that I did, took a break around the Undertaker event. Then... I had a good friend of mine that walked away from the game, came back. His name is Matt Black. You may know him as, R as Raw F Showtime on Twitter. But he stepped away from the game as well, came back, told me how things had changed. The community manager on Supercard had changed as well. So it was a lot more positive than negative. I'm like, you know, I might as well jump back on, give the game another shot. And here we are, ending Season 3, going into Season 4. Looking very much forward to it. But like I said, back in the day, these are what, if what you're seeing on your screen right now. These are what your cards look like. I'm looking forward to seeing the new designs in terms of Beast and Monster and Titan. So, so what you're going to want to do if you're viewing this tonight is get into your settings. While I'm at it, I rarely ever play music on these things. And to be honest, I have no idea what the music on this game sounds like with the exception of things that I've heard on other videos that other people have done. So, so we're just going to give you a bit of music, a little background, soothe your mind. What you're going to want to get in, hit, do is get into Manage Login. If you're viewing this the day before Season 3, you're going to want to make sure that your Facebook or Google Play or ever you log into the game, make sure those are saved because if you don't, you're going to get on the game tomorrow. You're going to get ready to play. You're going to see all your cards there. Or a correction. This is you're not going to see your cards there. Or your record because you're pretty much going to be wiped out. So make sure your information is saved. Either to Facebook or if you have Apple. You're going to want to save it to Game Circle. Both of those are going to be critical. So make sure that you have your that you have your stuff. So let's see. As a team... I am on the wonderful team of Viperville. Nine members at the moment. Thought I'd be able to get a tenth one, but got that started late. But we wound up getting the the Becky Lynch card for any nomination. For me, that is a pro. So I'm going to work on that tonight. Hopefully, I get a pro before tomorrow so I can see what my true tier is going to be in Season 4. If you're not aware, your rank, your tier is based on your top eight cards. So you don't have to play around with that. Oh, am I? I want. I don't have. You don't have to play around with that. Is my right cards in rank? Am I gonna mess up by putting these cards in and getting rewards that I really shouldn't be getting in favor of ones that I should be getting? But yeah, it's gonna be based on your top eight cards. That's gonna be your top four males, your top two females, and your top two sports. You never have to worry about that again. You're gonna, have, you're gonna have game modes like War, M the Elimination Chamber, the War of Rumble. Those are gonna be cycling every week. You're gonna earn points that you could use those points on things like card backs and cards and all other sorts of fun things. Um, World of Glory is still gonna be around. Team Ring Domination is still gonna be around. I'm not sure if we're gonna have an event this week or if they're gonna lift that weight a bit. Thing I'm kind of worried about is if they do have an event, what would the event card be? Because we've all seen what happened last time around when Goldberg was coming to the game as an ultimate card. A lot of people pissed. 
because they couldn't because they knew that they couldn't go for the card because they knew they couldn't get the pack C before that to do so. So if we have an event, we'll go into that. What in my future? Going into what you're gonna see from these in the future. I even I'm not sure. Am I gonna come at you a couple days a week? Am I gonna go come at you with like when I get rewards? And when new stuff comes in, I have no idea, but I'm going to try to come at you a little bit more often. So, so basically, you can tell that I'm going to in, be in the long haul for a while. Because right now, the views, I don't get as many views as all these other people do. To me, as long as one of your views is all I care about, because you've taken time at your schedule to visit me, to view me, to see what's going on. You may like it, you may not like it, but at least you've taken the time out of your day to view me. Yeah, like I said, as long as as long as at least one person views me, it makes it worth it. But I want to try to get more, a little bit more eyes on the on the videos here. So probably won't see as many pack openings from me because I really don't make that much money. I'm really not really not pulling in the bank. So you probably won't see too many pack opening videos from me. If you do, it's probably gonna be like one or two, nothing expansive. Be just a part of what I do and move on from there. Get hope that that will change in the future. But but I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did like it, throw a like on it. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, subscribe. with the notification bell on there so you know when future videos are happening. And I believe that is going to be about it. So once again, goodbye from Season 3. Looking forward to seeing a bunch of you in Season 4. Looking forward to facing a lot of you in the, P in the PvP mode that they're going to have as well. I hope you guys have fun with the game. All you guys that have left, come on back. <laughs> I know you probably thought you'd never hear that from me, but if you've left this game for a while, you're checking out this video, come on back because I, I doubt you're going to be disappointed. So that's going to be it for me today. So for WW Supercard, this is Double A. So see you next time. And so long from ringside. Goodbye, everybody.